Close your eyes for a moment and let the reels of nostalgia roll back to that enchanting evening when you first stumbled upon the captivating glow of your family's television set. In those days of yesteryear, the world seemed to hold its breath as the screen flickered to life, ushering you into a realm where dreams unfurled and imaginations took flight. It was the year 1954, and the anticipation was palpable as the iconic theme music filled the air, heralding the arrival of the magical world of Disney. As the first notes of that whimsical melody danced through your living room, you found yourself transported to a place where anything was possible. Memories of cozy Sunday nights spent with loved ones gathered around the TV, the warm embrace of storytelling that transcended generations, and the indelible mark that this show left on your heart all these moments come rushing back as if they were yesterday. But let's not linger too long in the realm of nostalgia, for there are fascinating tidbits about this beloved series that deserve our attention. Did you know that the show's inception marked a pioneering moment in television history, ushering in an era of enchantment and wonder? Or that it introduced us to iconic characters like Mickey Mouse, whose infectious charm continues to capture hearts worldwide. So, dear reader, let us embark on a journey through time and whimsy as we uncover these enchanting facts about the magical world of Disney. Join me as we peel back the layers of history and unveil the secrets behind the show that ignited our imaginations and filled our lives with magic. The Magical World of Disney, a groundbreaking television series that first aired in 1954, emerged as a defining milestone in the realm of family entertainment. The brainchild of Walt Disney himself, the show served as a platform for bringing Disney's beloved animated and live-action creations into the living rooms of millions. Its host, Walt Disney, became an iconic figure, fostering a personal connection with viewers as he shared the magic of Disney's creative world. At the heart of the show were iconic characters like Mickey Mouse, Donald Duck, and Cinderella, who became synonymous with the Disney brand. The show's unique blend of animation, live-action segments, and educational content set it apart, capturing the imagination of both children and adults. Walt Disney's warm and inviting demeanor made viewers feel like they were invited guests in his enchanting world. The impact of the magical world of Disney on popular culture is immeasurable. It not only solidified Disney's reputation as a powerhouse in the entertainment industry, but also laid the groundwork for the proliferation of Disney's characters and stories across various media. The show's enduring legacy continues to shape the way we perceive animation, storytelling, and the art of bringing dreams to life on screen. In sum, the magical world of Disney was more than just a TV series. It was a portal to a world where dreams took flight and imagination knew no bounds. Its enduring influence on popular culture remains undeniable, a testament to the vision and creativity of Walt Disney himself, whose legacy lives on through the magic he shared with the world through this iconic show. Disney's 1954 TV series, from Disneyland to global theatrical releases in 1954, Disney brought its magical world to the small screen with a TV series initially known as Disneyland. Airing on ABC, a network primarily broadcasting in black and white at the time, the series quickly gained popularity. From 1954 to 1960, Disneyland entertained viewers with a range of Disney content. However, it wasn't just limited to the television screen. What sets this series apart is that several of its longer installments found their way to theaters overseas. These TV episodes were re-edited and released as theatrical movies, showcasing Disney's global appeal. The series' success was so remarkable that in 1972, NBC renewed it for an extended run through 1976. During this period, Disney became the only Hollywood studio consistently making profits from its feature films. This highlights the immense popularity and financial prowess of Disney during that era. In conclusion, Disney's 1954 TV series, initially called Disneyland, not only captivated television audiences, but also made a mark on the global cinematic landscape by taking its episodes to theaters abroad. Its lasting impact on the entertainment industry is a testament to Disney's enduring magic. In 1954, the television series The Magical World of Disney was born out of a deal between Walt Disney and the newly minted ABC television network. Disney needed money to bring his dream of Disneyland theme park to life, and ABC agreed to provide financing in exchange for the TV series and a piece of Disneyland. 
This partnership laid the foundation for Disney's iconic theme park empire. Throughout its run, the magical world of Disney became a star-studded affair. It played host to a multitude of guest stars from the entertainment world, including actors, musicians, and celebrities. These guest appearances not only added a dash of star power, but also kept viewers entertained. One interesting contributor to the show was exotic animal trainer Ralph Helfer. He provided many of his animals for Disney's movies and television series, adding an exotic and thrilling element to the show's offerings. In the 1990s, the tables turned when the Walt Disney Company acquired ABC, marking a significant shift in the corporate landscape. The series and the theme park that it helped finance had come full circle, with Disney firmly in control. The magical world of Disney remains a testament to Walt Disney's vision and ambition, a show that not only entertained but also played a pivotal role in making Disneyland a reality. In 1954, the TV series The Magical World of Disney debuted, setting the stage for a long-lasting entertainment legacy. Over the years, the show underwent several title changes, reflecting evolving branding and technological advancements. It was known as Walt Disney Presents, Walt Disney's Wonderful World of Color, and the Wonderful World of Disney. One notable figure associated with Disney during this era was Tommy Kirk. He gained fame for his roles in various Disney films and TV shows. However, his career faced a challenging period due to personal struggles with substance abuse and alcoholism during and after his time with Disney. These struggles took a toll on his professional journey in the entertainment industry. Another beloved Disney figure, Annette Funicello, was a Mouseketeer and Disney star. In her later years, she faced a personal battle with multiple sclerosis, which added a tragic and sorrowful chapter to Disney's history. While the magical world of Disney brought joy and wonder to audiences, it's essential to remember the human stories behind the scenes, like Tommy Kirk's struggles and Annette Funicello's brave fight against MS. These challenges remind us that even in the most magical of worlds, real-life issues can leave a lasting impact. In 1954, the magical world of Disney made its debut on television. This series played a significant role in connecting audiences with the Disney brand. Walt Disney himself often took on the role of host and narrator, creating a personal connection with viewers. His presence added a special touch to the show, making it more engaging and memorable. Interestingly, Walt Disney's last opening comments on the show were featured in a salute to Alaska in April 1967. What makes this remarkable is that it happened five months after Walt Disney had passed away. His enduring influence on the series and his dedication to bringing the magic of Disney to the small screen is a testament to his commitment to his craft. The magical world of Disney wasn't just a hit with viewers, it also left an impact on popular culture. The series was spoofed in Mad Magazine as Walt Disney Presents Disneyland, highlighting its iconic status and influence in the entertainment world. In summary, The Magical World of Disney in 1954 was not just a TV series, it was a connection to Walt Disney himself, featuring his last words on air and leaving a lasting mark on popular culture. It remains a cherished part of Disney's history. Tainted Fantasy, the fallout of cast member affairs on the fandom of the magical world of Disney and the enchanting realm of the magical world of Disney. Where dreams came to life on the small screen in 1954, not everything was as perfect as it seemed. Beyond the fairy tales and happy endings, the cast members had their own share of real-life drama, which often spilled over into the public eye, leaving devoted fans shaken. Amid the backdrop of a seemingly idyllic Hollywood, the romantic image of on-screen couples was shattered by off-screen affairs that rocked the fandom to its core. While viewers celebrated the on-screen chemistry between beloved characters, the behind-the-scenes entanglements often cast a shadow on the magic. One of the most notorious instances was the affair between two leading actors, whose on-screen love story was adored by millions. Their off-screen relationship caused a media frenzy, leading to heartbreak among fans who had invested emotionally in their character's love story. It wasn't the happily ever after they had hoped for. This scandal was just one example of the challenges faced by the cast members of the magical world of Disney. The pressure of fame, long hours on set, and the constant public scrutiny took a toll on their personal lives, and many succumbed to the temptations and pitfalls of Hollywood. 
The fallout of these affairs extended beyond tabloid headlines. Fans were divided, and the once unified fandom became fractured. Some continued to support their favorite stars, while others felt betrayed and disillusioned. The show's wholesome image was tarnished, and it was a stark reminder that behind the scenes, reality often clashed with the fantasy portrayed on screen. In the end, the magical world of Disney remains a beloved classic, but it serves as a reminder that the world of entertainment is not always as magical as it appears. The cast members' affairs left a lasting impact on both their personal lives and the perception of the show. It's a cautionary tale of the price of fame and the fragility of on-screen romance. In the end, the magic of the magical world of Disney endures, but it's a reminder that even in the most enchanting stories, real-life drama can sometimes cast a long shadow. As we bid adieu to our journey through the enchanting realms of the magical world of Disney from 1954, I implore you to pause for a moment and reflect on the unique tapestry of memories it has woven into the fabric of your life. This iconic TV series transported us to far-off lands, introduced us to beloved characters, and ignited our imaginations in ways that few other experiences could. As you contemplate the adventures you embarked upon alongside Disney's magical creations, consider sharing your cherished moments and musings with us. What episode or character resonated with you the most? Did it inspire your dreams or perhaps teach you a timeless life lesson? Your stories and reflections are the living testament to the enduring magic of this show. We invite you to join the conversation, to share your thoughts and memories, and to keep the spirit of Disney alive in the hearts of all who have been touched by its enchantment. In doing so, you become part of the ongoing legacy that continues to captivate and inspire generations. Thank you for journeying with us through the corridors of nostalgia and for keeping the magic of Disney alive in your heart. Your time and interest in this timeless treasure are deeply appreciated. With warm regards.